Who do you love beating? <laughs> I love beating Sarah Crowley because it doesn't happen often. And yeah. when I, it does, because her and I are very similar. Yeah. So you know you've had a good race. It's like, it's, yeah, exactly. Similar that's to I think you and Ellie. Or... Yeah, that's that's true. It's hard with, though because Ellie's a good friend and I like really want to see her do well too. She says, right. I'm sure you do with Sarah. <laughs> yeah, selfishly you want to win all the time, but also we want to see your friends do well. So right, exactly. yeah, it's a hard one. <laughs> <laughs> I like beating any other Canadians actually, which is a bit <laughs> brutal, but like being the first Canadian at a race is yeah. kind of cool sometimes. Whether it's like Angela Nath or Heather Rotel or other competitive Canadians. That's kind of sometimes Actually, I, would, I would mirror that. Especially Kona, which I know you haven't right. said yet. Right, South American and Kona. Getting that, yeah, is always like That's a, a big thing. thing. Who do you hate losing to? I think usually when I look at a start list, I, in my mind, based on people's like recent races, have yeah. an idea of like where I could finish if it's realistic to win. If I'm healthy going into it, I, I if I know I have a chance of winning. And then if I don't win, I'm pretty disappointed no matter who it is who beats me. Yeah. <laughs> So, very politically. 70.3 is interesting because the fields are usually smaller and you have an idea of where you're going to finish. In ITU, you could have a good race and finish 20th. Right, so right. you really never had any idea. And when I was yeah, racing on that scene, it was more of a crapshoot. But in 70.3, I'm usually fairly confident that I can like be on the podium or, right. or something and not winning is always disappointing. <laughs> How about you? Do you have a person <laughs> or just the same kind of answer? Same. Okay. Sarah Crowley. <laughs> <laughs> Crowley, I'm coming for you. <laughs> Is there anyone who you've had a great battle with? Sarah Crowley. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, a That's couple awesome. years ago in Kona, we ran side by side for like... Oh, wow. I don't even remember now. 10 miles, 15 miles. Oh, my miles, gosh. So. I and, can't imagine that in Kona. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then the last two years, she's beat me in Kona, too. And then this year in Arizona, she showed up at for Ironman Arizona, so... Mm -hmm. But she had a crazy lead out of the swim, and then we just, it was the same split the whole time. So Yeah, I think We're, my most memorable, like, battle with someone, two things actually come to mind. Helen Jenkins in Kitzbühel one year, we were head-to-head -head going into the final lap, and I honestly didn't think I could go any harder or beat her in any way. But I had this, like, finishing kick for some reason in every race I did. The last 800 I was really good at, so that's where I pulled away from her. Actually, we had a couple of battles. Madrid also, we were head-to-head. -head. And also Lisa Nord and her and I had a couple of head-to-head -head battles. Yeah. And in ITU, it all comes down to, like, the last home stretch, and it's usually a sprint finish. So, <laughs> yeah, we've had a couple good close finishes. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> I've had two of those before. Actually, one was with Sarah Groff. Hmm. Or now Sarah True oh, at yeah. Alcatraz. Oh, really? I caught her with like half a mile to go. Oh, and for the win. For the win, yeah. Oh, exciting. So she it was just after the 2012 game, so she oh, had never she had a raced, race there. yeah, like longer, I don't think. So. Oh, cool. That's it exciting. Was, yeah. And she's just come fourth at the Olympics. And then Chattanooga one year, Meredith and I, Kessler and I ran side by side for 10 miles. Wow. That's cool. And then, yeah, it was like, you've raced Chattanooga. It was that final hill. Super hilly. Yeah. I just started sprinting up it. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. I've never had a sprint finish in a 70.3 and I okay. don't really want to. Yeah. <laughs>